Sayok's criminal history goes back to at least 1991, and in 2002, he was convicted for making a bomb threat in Miami-Dade against Florida Power and Light. Sayok called FPL upset about the amount he was billed. According to court documents I've obtained, Sayok said he didn't deserve it and he was going to blow up FPL. FPL will get what they deserve and it will be worse than 9-11, Sayok said. And he told an FPL employee he was going to blow her head off. That call was recorded and he was arrested. In 2015, Sayok was arrested at a West Palm Beach Walmart for trying to walk out without paying for a briefcase and some luggage. He was also that year charged in Broward County with petty theft. And from then back to 1991, his charges ranged from grand theft, tampering with evidence, battery, fraudulent refunds, and having and selling steroids. Sayok was put on probation for the FPL bomb threats. At one time, he was also involved in a domestic violence dispute with a woman who appears to be his grandmother. That woman later withdrew her complaint against Sayok. Since 2015, he hasn't appeared to have been in any criminal trouble in Florida until now as he's facing multiple federal charges. Felicia.